A core could be millions of years old and never touched by human hands. You're the first person to see it, it's quite interesting. We're here drilling for the long-term restoration of the Palace of Westminster. So this is looking at the geology, testing the clay and the rock. As part of the restoration and renewal program, the Delivery Authority commissioned a six-month study into a marine ground investigation to better understand the river conditions in and around the palace. And effectively, we used the barge as a stable platform to drill 14 boreholes, some of them as deep as the Channel Tunnel. We had uh, the Lord Speaker and the Deputy Speaker of the House of Commons visit the barge, visit the crew and witness some of the drilling works that was ongoing. And I think this is a really important opportunity for us to showcase the importance of these marine borehole works that we're doing. It's been quite nice knowing we've had positive communications with people from within Parliament who have been interested in what we're doing and not just looking at us as a metal object making noise outside the window. It's usually you undertake a project and then a few years down the line you'll see the end result of the project, you'll see a new road, you'll see a new bridge in place. But this is more a long term, you know that something you've done now might be being built so it will remain there for a long time into history. So this will be the best that we've ever known the palace since it was originally built by Charles Barry back in the 1830s. And this, the Marine Ground Investigations, is just one of many surveys that we're doing to inform that really deep understanding of the palace. We've got other works going on. We've got drone surveys going on, doing millimetre precision surveys of the roofs. We've got material specialists trying to understand the strength of the walls and the ceilings. And we've got a whole range of collections care people understanding all the artefacts that are in the building. And all of this is building a really strong body of knowledge to inform future design proposals and future decisions about the restoration and renewal programme.